Hello everybody, this is Charles and I'm back with uh, part 3 of my Great Mike Game Review. This time for us, uh, let's start off with Mike Gunner. So Mike Gunner is the train uh, that becomes a weapon of uh, Great Mike Game, but of course uh, he can transform into his robot. Uh, so let me just get into it immediately. First you're gonna pull out this. You have to uh, release the arms. Okay, tap them in place. <coughs> then uh, you have to um, move this to the back, push this all the way in. If he has to hear that sound, it's supposed to be uh, his weapon mode. Um, remove the fist. I have um, some problems getting the fist of this object too tight, so what I need to do, I need to first form his weapon. Okay, and I'll insert uh, the weapon into the fist hole and get it out this way yep and uh, what I'm gonna do okay release uh lift down the feet push this pull this and uh, after which I am going to move the guns out a little bit with the head up and there we have um Mike Gunner in robot mode okay oops sorry so Mike Gunner in robot mode. Uh, very simple uh, looking robot. Um, well, he, he, in order to show his uh, weaponry, let me just show you what I can do. The sounds are actually very boring. You just pull this trigger to the back, which is very hard to pull back. Yes, you can hear the sound. You can hear the loading sound. I can't really load it in place right now. Let me just try again. Okay. Great, I got it loaded. So what you do is pull the trigger and you will see the lights in front of you. Yeah. Hear the click sound and this is when you pull the trigger. Yeah. It's very hard to pull the trigger to the back, uh, maybe because this toy is old. It's quite hard to lock it in place. Let me just try again. Yeah. Okay. And uh, if you notice, when you pull the trigger, this uh, turret turns as well. It actually turns. So it's quite quite interesting. So this is Mike Gunner in his uh, robot mode. Um, I will transform him to his um, gun mode later. But uh, of course, let's go to the main task, which is a uh, great Mike Gain. So okay, I have Mike Gain with me here. Okay, tall guy, and. Um, Prior to the, this video, I actually detached all the individual parts. Okay, so I'm just gonna form Great Mike again directly. So first, what we are gonna do, we're gonna lift the legs part down, push this to the back, lift this, push this to the back. Um, this orange part is gonna come here. Just there's, there's a catch here, so just gonna slot in very very nicely. Similarly for this green part. Uh, slot in here very very nicely and we have formed the feet for great much again right uh, next up I'm going to form the chest first so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna pull this out pull this apart um, lift this orange part out lift this out as well this is going to go inside this is going to go inwards and uh, I'm gonna take out the, the train parts first. I'm gonna use this from the chest of Great Mike Gain. Okay. And then we're gonna put the hands back. From here, uh, we are going to form the chest piece before the jet. I'm gonna move this to the back. Alright, move this inwards and it's going to cache over here to form the waist piece. Okay, you can see we are more or more less done. Um wings. Wings go to the back here. Another one go to the back here. Okay. Okay. And uh, this part, now I just form the arms first. So for the arms it's very simple. This uh, I believe goes in here. How do I cache them? 
can't remember how I get how got this part done. I know it's something similar to this. Um, okay, I'm gonna look at the instructions for this part. Oh, I just realized that I had the hands the other way around for this side. Oh well, pardon me. Okay, let me just take a quick look at the instructions on uh, how I'm gonna get the hands to fit in. There are supposedly some catches. Uh, oh, there's a catch here. Did I get this right? Oh no, this is for this side. Okay, now it makes sense. Okay, so this is for this side. Okay. A little bit of doing. Hmm. Let's see how I'm gonna fit it in nicely. It's supposed to catch very very nicely, but doesn't seem to be the case for me right now. It's supposed to be a very simple transformation. I'm gonna take another look at the instructions. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, it says this part at the bottom catches in here. If I got correct, and oh man, I'm wrong again. This is supposed to be here, uh, and this is supposed to be here. And yes, I believe I got it right now. Yep, this is supposed to be the correct side. So for this side, uh, similarly, there's a catch over here, a catch over here, and a catch over here, and yes. I've got the arms together now. And then now for the chest piece, uh, just place them in here. Open up this three panels. The one of the drill rather. Oops! Oh 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 oops. My bad, my bad, my bad. This thing came back out. Uh, okay. Here and finally for the head piece. Camera. Head piece. Okay, this is so massive a piece that I can't really get in my camera completely. Uh, slot in here. And we have great mic gain. I'm gonna push him all the way to the back. So this is the uh, great mic gain. Another big piece, a big robot. Um, as I mentioned in my first video, I don't like the combined form in the sense that the arms are so short. It's just so disproportionate. But you know, as a, as a toy, he looks really massive and really cool. And uh, to top it up, to finish him up, uh, we're gonna form, we're gonna have a Mike Gunner com combined with him. Gonna place this piece. Let me see. Instructions. I'm getting my instructions to uh, see how I'm gonna fit them in correctly. So this part, okay, I gotta flip this down. Okay, flip this yellow piece down, which is a little bit stuck. Uh, typical of a old toy. Uh, place it inside. Hmm, let me see where it's supposed to fit in. Oh, so apparently, oh, it's gonna just fit in here. Hmm. Okay. Oh. I see. I'm, I'm not supposed to put this in first. Oh, it says I'm supposed to take this out, uh, place it in here, and fit this in. Yeah. Oh, okay. So this is how it works. Um, but for my gun, oh, my gun is similar. Okay. But before that, I'm just gonna transform my gunner to his gun form, which is uh, I'm gonna keep the first, keep the first. I think I'm gonna rotate this downwards to be correct. Gonna push him. Okay. This lever is gonna look this way. Gonna push his head down. Okay. The legs go in. Okay. Cans come out. And they'll fit in here. Oh, yeah. Oh wow, okay, and uh, the hands are by the side, that's correct, 
And what I'm gonna do right now is to fit my gunner here on the top. Okay. Okay, fits in nicely. Uh, well, relatively nicely. Hmm. Strange and okay. So I'm gonna fit him here. Okay. My gain's head seems to get in the way. The full combined head seems to get in the way. I'm trying to find a way where I can actually just move in. Okay. Looks slightly crooked, but oh well. And I'm gonna put the wing piece here. And there we have great my gain in its complete form. If I was drawing gun on the shoulder. Cool, 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 cool. And uh, wrap it up, I'm gonna have his sword with him. So this is a uh, great might gain in his combined form. It's a really, really massive piece, as you can see. Um, I have problems of fitting him into my camera completely. Yeah, just gonna push him further to the back. And yes, there we see him. It's a very, very big piece. Cool. Um, really nice, you know, you don't get, like I said in my vintage toy reviews, don't get the uh, toys this big anymore these days, you know. It's really massive, it's, it's heavy, it's, it's fun, you know. It doesn't look the best in terms of aestheticness, but you know, in terms of playability, definitely it's there. In terms of durability, definitely it's there. So, you know, it's really, really cool, you know. So this is um, part three, you know, part three of my my um, reviews on uh, Brave series toys, uh, taking everybody down memory lane. Um, definitely there will be more coming up. So as long as uh, you people like it, I will definitely um, showcase the rest of my um, Brave series uh, robots. I have Goldron, Goldron. I have um, Gal Geiger, I have... Um, I can't remember the name of this robot. Um, you know, it comes with a, a jumbo jet and a crane, so that's the one. And I have, the, oh, I have a J Decker as well. So yeah, those are some of what I have. I'm, I'm gonna review my my uh, video review next time. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this uh, video review and uh, enjoyed um, watching this. So here's Charles signing off with yet another toy review. Do stay tuned to my channel for more reviews next time.